and just very pretty, very feminine. Feminine is very classy, which is also very sexy. That's what I think that should be. But I actually like something like a Catwoman type, something, something skin tight, leathery, you know, something like that too. Because it's sexy, it's feminine. It, show, you know, it shows what, what women are, are really, you know, the sensual and stuff like that. I think that's very sexy. Costumes are uh, supposed to be a creative side of you. So if you feel like being sexy, then you'd put a sexy costume on. If you feel like being um, grungy, then you'd, you'd dress in grunge and leather and, you know, things like that. It, it's just all about mood setting. It's what type of mood you're in and, and things, of, things like that. I would probably, because we went to a photo shoot not so long ago and my friend wore a tutu and I'm into like little, because I like things that flow nicely, femininity. I like a, like a tutu with some nice little leggings maybe and a nice little top or something. I don't know. I think a black swan would be awesome. Too far is when you're exposed in your private areas and stuff like that and, and, you're, and you're, you know, disgracing yourself by, by dressing inappropriately around people. I think that's something you should do behind closed doors. However, if you want to voice your opinion like gay pride stuff, we have the gay pride parade, they dress like all flamboyants with their rainbow wigs and, you know, and, and their bowings and everything like that. They're not harming anyone, they're not insulting anyone, they're just voicing their opinion on how they feel, they feel happy. You don't want to dress too inappropriately, so guys are fondling you and stuff like that, but if someone does come over and want to fondle you, you just give them a little shove and give them a little look and then they know to back off you. And, and if that's the case, then you shouldn't be in that situation, you should remove yourself and go somewhere else. Well, it depends on what you're wearing. So if, I, if I'm dressed like a ballerina, like a black swan, I'm going to feel like a dancer. So I'm going to stand tall and stand proud and just be confident. Body pain can, 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 can make you feel sensual if it's, if it's done properly. You know, fem, like I am more for the femininity side. I don't like bold. I don't like anything gaudy. I don't like the gothic look. I like just, a, you know, little, little, you know, little body paints pretty, you know, covers up the, you know, your, your, your areas that you don't want to expose, yet shows the creative side of you. So if you're into like flowers and stuff and you do a little flowery body paint, that would be think. Just dress appropriately, you know, um, use good taste when dressing, feel free to express yourself because it's, we're in America and that's what, you know, we have, we have freedom of choice, freedom of the way we dress. However, though, there are people around, so, you know, dress appropriately. You, you would, if you were a parent or something like that, you wouldn't want your children seeing someone out with, with no clothes on, of course. So just dress appropriately and, and don't, you know, try to insult anybody by the way you dress. That's all right. And have fun. It's all about having fun and expressing who you are. <laughs> 